Okay guys, we're directly after... I'm recording this directly after when we just stopped, so... Here we go again! So, if you guys are wondering why I stopped... It's because I'm trying to make sure that these episodes... Are, um... I'm trying to make these episodes more digestible, because I know with strategic games, you're supposed to keep, like, a good amount of, um... You're supposed to record a lot, and we, like, upload a lot, but with this kind of game, it's more about... I would say it's more about just relaxing and taking your time with the game. I mean, this is more of... What I mean by that is just... You, this is more of a digestible game. It's more about just kind of relaxing, kind of taking things slow, kind of, you know... It's going to be a while before we'll have enough to do a lot in this game, but... And please unclick. Please unclick. Please unclick. Please unclick. Oh my goodness. Give me one second, guys. Okay, guys. What I basically had to do was reload the game and... And, uh, restart everything. But now we're back and now I can begin everything once again with my looting and... Happiness and... Stuff. But I really don't think... I'm... I'm really debating on if I need any more... You know... Things besides just... Uh... Bed what I'm basically saying, guys, is bedrooms are very dangerous, okay? As you guys all know, bedrooms are extremely dangerous. And since we already have what we need in terms of bedrooms, all we don't really need to go back there. All we really need at this point is actual food. Because we have a duffel bag, we have like th two school bags, and we have a tote bag. I have my survival bag. Well, I guess in my survival bag, I do need to add matches and cigarettes and start... You know, making it an actual survival bag. Okay, so I can obviously not see through there. Ah. <laughs> yes! Please stop banging on the window while I just casually escape. Do 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 do. I'm just going to mummy away. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna walk. I'm just gonna shuffle late. Shimmy. Everyone, shimmy! Shimmy away! Shimmy! Oh, this guy's just not gonna give up, is he? Okay, yeah, he seems to be very content about finding me and killing me. So I'm just gonna help him. Wow. There we go. Okay. So yeah, we're just going to... I think we're going to have to make shop up in this house. I don't know if this is actually... I hope there's no alarm. This would really ruin my day if there was an alarm. But of course, let me guess. There is? There is an alarm? Can I please get this open before I die? Can I please get this open before I die? Can I please get this open before I die? Okay. I just need to make sure... Okay. Ah! Okay, my phone just vibrated. That scared me. Alright, so yeah, I'm just going to quickly sleep right here. Oh, come on, it's a futon. Yeah. I was about to say, you should be able to sleep on a futon. I'm glad... I'm also glad they don't actually have a system in store where, um... Where you have to, like... Certain things will give you more sleep and other things will not give you... Will give you less sleep. That'd be so hard to keep track of, because I... Because I love this, the cheat right now where you can just like sleep on almost anything and you get about the same amount of sleep as anything. Uh, okay, we're finally in the daytime. So, Mil James Miller is doing... James Miller, after moving around a little bit, has has really, really been looking for a new home. I mean, he's definitely trying to figure out where to live in this new place in Murtaugh. And, oh... I, 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 you know, I would be an idiot not to take this. And you know what? I am an idiot because you know what? It's going to spoil before I'll be able to eat this. I just know it will. Like, I, 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 I feel so tempted right now, but I know I won't be able to eat any of this fast enough to... You know what? I'll eat the care. I'll eat the egg right now. Okay. Let's get out of here. Making sure there's no zombies. Let's see if there's any, like... Stuff over here. No, we just have crowbar. All right, so yeah, we're just can now continuing to just loot down. I think I'm going to yeah. I'm, first, let me. I'm just gonna keep heading downwards. Hopefully, I'm also looking at these boxes to see if there's some kind of um. Because sometimes you can get really lucky in some of these boxes and sometimes find really. Okay, I'm just gonna walk this way. Shimmy over here. Sometimes you can find really, 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 really good stuff. And other times you can't really find anything. So let me see. Let's just do this a couple times. Okay. So apparently you gain about... If you have one zombie in sight, you gain about... 
nimble, nimble. Yeah, you gain about one point per second. So I'm just gonna, you know, shimmy past here. Just, just like I'm looking at her, but ah, oh, damn, in pain. What did I do? I'm not over encumbered, so I don't think it's that. Oh, I probably caught a cold. That's what happened. Probably just caught a cold because it doesn't seem like I'm damaged in any other way. So I should probably, you know, stop shimmying. I mean, James. I mean, Miller is trying to improve his dance here, but he's really got to learn the boundaries to how much you should dance. Okay, I did not do that. That was not me. That was totally not me. Okay? Like, for once, I can agree that this was not my fault. Like, seriously, what did that... What? That was totally not me. I, I totally can say it was not me for once. Okay, but I think the motel is right over there. No, that's po POC. POC, what does that sound for? Polaroid Artery Certificates. Polaroid Artery Certificates. That's what that stands for. Oh, shoot. I'm going to have to run a little bit further. Lose them in my line of sight. That way they can... Ah, okay, I'll just stay over here. Ah, no, no! Just, just keep running this way. Just keep running this way. That guy died of a terrible death. Okay, I'm just going to keep... Yeah, yeah, just keep dragging everyone else away from me. Okay, good. Yeah, it seems like all these hordes are starting to be moved by the fact... Ah, oh, dang it. Yeah, I'm definitely in the worst place. Yeah, severe pain. Probably caused by the fact I do not want to take off my sweater. I'm too stubborn to take off my sweater. Um, just gonna keep moving up. I'm definitely way too upwards right now, but I'm just trying to make sure I disavoid most of the main hordes. Um, severely pain. I'm really gonna have to like hold up in a place for a second. What I'll probably do is go to the warehouse for now. I'm gonna go check out some stuff. And my glint's almost leveled up. And you know what? For once, I don't think I'll be. I think I'll probably stick with the bat. And I know you guys, a lot of you guys thinking, James, you should stick with the axe. It's the best weapon in the world. Yada yada. Yeah, I know it's the best weapon in the world, but you know what? Blunt. Blunt is not that bad either. Blunt is pretty dang good. Once you get it high enough level, it's going to be pretty dang good. So that's what I'm going to try to do. And I completely bypassed a lot of those zombies. I'm just going inside the bet. Used to be the best hideout in the world. Now that they've basically decreased the spawn rate of everything. And now make this completely useless as a warehouse. It stinks now. Shotgun shells. Like, I can find shotgun shells in here. How does that make sense? Like, how does... Okay... I could see an axe being in here, but why do I have shotgun shells? And I mean, they pack it in such a way to where... Uh, I don't know, I, I may be getting a little bit too nitpicky here, but th it doesn't make sense. If, if you're going to disclude the axe, you should definitely include... Yeah, you see, I'm finding so many shotgun shells, it's like, what the heck? Paint makes sense. I could see why there's so much paint in here, because it's a warehouse. You know, it's supposed to be paint, there's also supposed to be nails, saws, you know, all this kind of jazz, but, you know... Don't get it. Just don't get it, guys. Oh, a lighter. Wait, wait. I actually do need a lighter. So we're going to have to start setting up our good old goodie bag. Okay, where is it? There it is. All right, let's put that in our goodie bag. So now we just need to find the cigars, the cigarettes. And we should be good at that point. Okay, so we have buckets. Sledgehammer. Do we need a sledgehammer? No. Sledgehammers are completely useless in this version right now since they can't actually knock down any walls. And they're basically a death trap if you try to go fight a zombie with them. Oh my goodness. Why am I even trying to look through here? Because I'm trying to hope that they have something of value in here. But I already... Yeesh. Man, I hate the spawn rate now. <laughs> uh, I hate the spawn rate. Well, at least I got a saw though. So I got a saw. So that's not going to be too bad when I start construction. Planks. That's kind of good. But I was hoping for more. Turquoise. You know, that is actually pretty good. <laughs> I won't complain there. Okay, so let's put that in our, um... Yeah, let's put it in our goodbye bag. Goodbye... Oh, and I found a hammer! Okay, never mind. This place still has good stuff. It still has goodies. So let's see, move that to over there. Okay, don't know why it's actually weighing down on my character so much. Um... Seems like we're probably going to have to move the shotgun over here because it's giving up too much room. We'll probably put about six shells into it and we'll basically consider that that actually belongs to this bag right here. With my shoes too. Because it's also my shoes. Alright, and let's eat some... 
Let's eat some stuff, some chips, some chips everyone, some chips. Alright. Alright. And we're also going to take the hammer for construction reasons. Because we need the hammer. And James Miller. Alright, and water bottle still good. Okay, now let's take some of these shotgun shells into this inventory. Actually, you know what we could do right now? Alright, let me do this quickly, 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 quickly. Uh, saw, saw, shotgun, where's the shotgun? Get this out. Alright, what we're going to do is we're actually going to make a sawed off shotgun. Because sawed off shotgun is actually way better sawn off shotgun yet yeah, sawn off shotguns are lighter and better for your shotgun because they actually can hold off they can actually do a lot more damage and a lot more stuff you don't even need to like take out things all right so let's put this back in here let's put this oh shoot a helicopter that's never a good sign that's never a good sign i'm not even done looting okay i'm still over encumbered why what am i doing okay maybe I, okay i'm probably just gonna have to move everything over here because for some reason it's just like seems like we can't take any weight in this tote bag so I think I'm just gonna have to move everything out of here for some reason don't know why in fact we could probably just drop this um let's just drop the tote bag there we go All right so yeah we know zombies are gonna start heading towards our position um, basically what I think of as helicopters, the helicopters come when, when there are basically no zombies around you. So, we were safe for a little bit, but now zombies are going to start coming to our position. And I'm going to have to quickly loot all this place. I'm definitely going to, once I get the hotel established, I'm definitely going to have to come back here because there was a lot of good loot. And we're actually running closely on time, so I want to thank you guys for watching. This was a pretty productive episode. We got a shotgun. We got a sawed off shotgun. Yeah, this, this, they're coming to me. Oh, now now they're just mocking me. Now they're seriously just mocking me. Now, they're seriously just right outside the door waiting for me to come out. Ugh. Seriously, why do they have... To, why do the helicopters just not help you at all? They're actually more of a hindrance than help. It's like, okay guys, you, you guys can stop ho hovering over the city. We know you guys are doing Reddit reconnaissance or something. But seriously... I don't need this. I don't need you guys to keep constantly coming back. It's just like a death trap. But anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time in Motel, California. The next episode, I give you my word, we will go actually to the motel. Okay, guys, see you guys next time.